Hello everyone and welcome back to Shire Farm. You join me as we're just cracking on with getting the grass um, picked up with our new Pottinger Forage Wagon. Now we, bought, we spoke about this in the last episode and uh, we said that we were going to get one of these and we have. We've got a Farrow 3510 so uh, hopefully this should serve the farm really well and uh, allow us to get a lot more uh, silage put into the pits and then we can uh, get some more money onto the farm. So let's get this field started and I shall see you on the other side. Many thanks. We're just on to the uh, last strip, literally just got the whole field done now. I think we'll take this to the uh, pit, get it emptied, and then we're going to have the fun job of trying to level everything out and uh, get it compacted. Now, that's always a fun job that uh, I'm not sure everybody else enjoys. I'm not a massive fan of it personally, but uh, hopefully it shouldn't take too long with uh, the levelling uh, spade or the levelling blade that we've actually got here. So we will crack on, get this emptied, get it levelled, and then we'll see what other little jobs might need doing around the farm. So I look forward to seeing you on the other side. Many thanks. completely compacted now so that's good so we've got 279,587 litres so if we can blanket the bunker there we go fantastic so let's see uh, I think that will probably be a, a in the next game we'll look at maybe getting that to market or maybe even looking at um, seeing when the best price is now when will that be let's have a quick look and we think that might B, I think so chaff is there uh, let's have a quick look at silage uh, it's full 3x shower grain full 
50 January. Okay, so it's climbing. So hopefully we might be able to time this right. I'm quite happy if we sold this early anyway, just in case to get a bit more money back in the bank and to pay a few things off. Now, I don't think there's any other jobs on the farm that we can do, John. So let's have a quick check of the animals. So sheep look good. Yeah, water, wool still quite good. Well, we've just sold the wool, so we're, we're getting back to that. Chickens, yeah, all these, uh, okay. Uh, eggs are getting close, so uh, that's not too bad. So I think what we'll probably do is uh, oh use the tractor actually right? put his weights back and uh, we may as well actually yeah put all these weights back now we've used them to compact the silage and then we can pick up that silage leveler i think would be a good idea and we'll probably look at moving some of the eggs um, away from the chicken area quickly and then we'll skip into next We'll uh, skip into next month, or actually the second day of May, because that'll be the next thing to do. And then I think we should be able to put a little bit of liquid fertilizer on field 38, hopefully, um, which should help um, get up to 100% fertilization and get the sorghum up to a good state. So um, that should be good. I'll just do this quickly. I'm pretty, oh, has it not registered it? No, no. Uh, let's see if we actually. <laughs> oh, this is not the best way to do it, but. Aha! Work though. Brilliant. I'll take that. <laughs> what we'll do, we'll put it at the side of the silage pit. Because if we don't, it will just fall over again, won't it? So, do that. Ah, that's better. So, I think what we'll do, like I said, we'll just have a quick look at how many eggs we've actually got in the chicken area. Because I'm guessing it's probably nearly full. And that might be a good way to get a little bit of money back because we are uh, looking a little bit brassic to be honest with you. We've only got 9,100. Um, so we, it's not brilliant that. So let's just leave the tractor here a minute. And we'll uh, actually let's have a quick look first. I'm pretty certain. Yeah, okay. Uh, yeah, pretty much nearly full. So I tell you what, we'll, we'll take a pallet or so or two away from there anyway. So let's get our uh, nice little pallet truck out. I have seen actually on Mod Hub that there is a new pallet truck mod that just got released recently, um, a manual one. So that could be quite interesting to maybe uh, get hold of and try. It didn't look like it was very expensive either as a uh, as a uh, vehicle so that could be quite fun to try. So let's just at least get one of these out of the way because then if we end up going to the next uh, day in May, we're probably going to get errors where it's going to constantly say that there's not enough space to spawn any more eggs. So we'll just get this put away and we'll feed the dog and then we shall move into May the 2nd. So yeah, we'll do that. That down, reverse that out. Fantastic. Okay, so let's feed the dog. There you go, Todd. Another full bowl for you. And let's uh, skip into the uh, second day in May. See you on the other side. Good morning, everyone. And I'm just moving some more egg pallets out of the way because I think we're probably going to have to move into June shortly because I don't think there's any jobs we can do. And we won't be able to do the fertilising on field 38 either um, because it's not actually past another month. So I think what we'll do, we'll just get these loaded in here quickly. It won't take too long, I don't think. And then we'll probably skip on. Uh, we'll do a final check on the animals and then we'll skip on to June. And I think that's going to get get us really close to uh, getting on to the episodes where we'll be doing our first harvesting of the top of Field 3 and the bottom of Field 3. Now, I think it will be the bottom of Field 3 first. So it will be the barley crop, I believe. But I can check that in a second. Let's have a quick look. Pretty certain it will be the barley crop that will be first. So let's have a quick look at that. Sorry, oat. Sorry, that's the oat actually, isn't it? I believe uh, oat is June, July. Okay, so it probably won't be till Ju July. So it will give us a bit of time to actually do some of the jobs in June. So that's fine. So that should be good. So. We'll get this finished off because I think what we'll do by the time we've moved into June, there'll probably be so many eggs 
that that'll be another little job we'll need to do. So I think June may be uh, a month of just doing a few little jobs around the farm, finishing off field 38, so we can actually uh, get that fully fertilised ready for the sorghum to grow. So we'll do that, I think. We'll put this down, go from there, turn off our little uh, pallet truck. We'll just have a quick check of the animals. I'm pretty certain. Yeah, they're still good, food's good. I don't think we're going to get away with actually being able to wait till the sorghum's ready, are we? No, we'll probably have to buy some more grain at some point. But oh well, we should be okay. Um, and obviously the sheep, apart from the water, I don't think we're in uh, any real problems at all with that. So I think, oh, two will do. Contracts? None. Okay. This map really doesn't have many contracts, which does it does make um, winter work, etc. a little bit more troublesome. And also when you're waiting for things. So hopefully that will get better as we get more and more fields and we get some more jobs to do. So I think what we'll do, we'll move this into June and we've got have a few little jobs to do then. So I'll see you then. Good morning, everyone. And uh, you join me as I'm just doing the weeding on the field 35. It's actually not weeding, but we're, we're just taking this back to a 100% fertilised state without having to spend any money. Now, uh, we're at the same point we were probably about, ooh, I don't know, about three or four episodes ago, maybe more, where we've got no money and we're doing the uh, point where we can take this back to 100%. So I think uh, this is a pretty good little job to, uh, to get done in uh, the first day of June. Now, um, I have also done the spraying very quickly on field 38 near the dealership to get that up to 100%. So we're just getting all these little jobs done ready because I think the next episode or two incoming, um, probably uh, the end of this week or into next week, will be the big harvesting uh, contracts or jobs on the farm. So, um, yeah, I think we'll just get these little few bits done and uh, get this cracked on. So uh, I'll take this to a time lapse and I'll look forward to seeing you on the other side. Many thanks. bit done now so let's uh, get this all uh, packed up stacked away and uh, I very much appreciate you watching and uh, I hopefully see you in the next episode many thanks